channel. Today I have my first collaboration video with Halo Beauty. She is a gorgeous, gorgeous guru that is here on YouTube and does the same exact things that I do, which is reviewing a lot of products and also showing a lot of makeup tutorials. She is all things beauty. And let me tell you, she and I also decided to do this collaboration um, because she actually had won my giveaway not too long ago. So ever since then, we've just been actually keeping in touch and it was for my Pure Day Art giveaway. So I've actually been following her for a while now on YouTube. So it's pretty cool that we actually have the same things in common. And she just like reminds me of me, just like her personality sometimes and how she is. She is really, really Really awesome you guys need to go check her channel out she is super super talented just very down to earth oh and also mind you we actually do have something in common that I need to also show you and present to you and this actual guest has been on my videos before Bruce come here obviously I'm calling a dog oh here he comes he wants to be on YouTube come here Oh, right. So he's probably gotten a little fatter since you've seen him, but here he is. So me and Halo Beauty actually have, um, dude, look at the camera, please. <laughs> actually have the same exact dogs. They're French Bulldogs, and they are both fawn. So I thought that was pretty cool. I'm like, holy crap, this girl is like the other half of me. So it was super, super cool. And Brewski likes to show a lot of love, don't you? A little bucket. He's probably like, whoa, what a bright light right now, man. So this is Brewski, and please go check out her cute French Bulldog too as well. Anywho, so we are both sharing a collaboration today that is based on smoky eye looks. And the smoky eye looks actually contain, hers is going to be more of a night evening look for a smoky eye, and mine's going to be considered more of a day smoky eye. So this is the first collaboration I've ever done on YouTube, and I'm super, super excited to for you guys to see what I came up with and also to see what she came up with too as well. So please go check out Halo Beauty and give her some support because she's amazing and make sure you thumbs up on both of these videos. And if you want to see how we got this look, please stay tuned and keep watching. Using the Urban Decay Primer Potion, I'm going to go in and then I'm going to put this all over my eyelids so this way it keeps the eyeshadow on all day without having to retouch. Then going in with the first color cover and using this as a transition color inside my crease in windshield wiper motion. Then taking the color undone and smoking this out in the outer corners of the eye using my e.l.f. brush. This brush is absolutely amazing. For $4, I got it at Target, and it's been doing the works for me. And just taking this almost to the mid part of the eye, but leaving the mid section of this eye look open so that when you go to put the lighter natural color, it does have enough room to be applied. And then putting a little bit more of that smoked look in the tear duct area. Then just repeating this process. Next is my Morphe brush. I love this crease brush, you guys. I've been missing out for a while. Everybody's been raving about them. Super cheap. I got mine for like $12. And I'm just taking the color undone and I'm just transitioning and adding a little bit of depth into the eye. And let me tell you something, great starter brushes especially. They're super cheap and what great quality. Using the Urban Decay YDK eyeshadow and my MAC eyeshadow brush, I'm going to be applying this in the mid section of the eye. And it's such a nice neutral glam color that you can't go wrong with. And I'm just applying it even over the undone just a tiny bit so you don't see any lines. And just packing on the pigment and doing the same process on the other eye. Then just adding a little bit more of the color on done and just lifting up the crease a little bit just to really smoke it out and open up the eyes more. This brush just makes you look like you blend like a pro, you guys. Then taking a little bit more of the color cover and adding my transition shade a little higher. 
and get ready to use the skimp color from my Naked 2 Basics palette to put underneath the brow and just highlight and get more of that shape to definition of my brow. Next, taking L'Oreal Cream Eyeliner and using the brush that came with it, I must say, the whole time I was using an angled brush and I thought that was easy, but oh my gosh, why wasn't I using this the whole time? I threw so many of them away. But it really helps to precise and get that nice fine tip of a cat eye look. But it's really great because there's no creasing throughout the day. Then taking 24-7 pencil by Urban Decay and lining this in the inner part of my rim in the color Zero. Does not move or run. Then taking the color cover again with my Smudger Eyeshadow Brush by Stila. And just doing it very lightly because you don't want to smoke it out too much. Then taking my 217 Red Cherry Lashes and applying that right on top of my liner. And these are 100% human here. They're super, super comfortable. I love them. They don't poke or anything. Then taking my Smashbox X-Rated Mascara. As you guys know, I did have this video in my last Ulta Haul 2016, my review. I absolutely love this mascara. Awesome separation. Then taking the Thrilled Lip Liner by Bare Minerals. These are very long lasting. And this is like a pinky nude that you can pair up with any nude lipstick or any pink lipstick. And the lipstick I am using is Bare Minerals in the color Breakaway. Long lasting and very hydrating. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And until next time, bye beauties.